Good morning, super cool party people. It is Saturday morning and I am getting ready to go to work. I feel like I slept pretty well last night. I definitely had weird dreams where I was flying in planes like everywhere and also having history lessons on those planes and somebody brought their service kangaroo on one of the planes. I didn't know that was a thing. Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna finish getting ready here, probably have my breakfast drink before I leave the house because I've got a couple minutes. And then away I go for a fun-filled day of excitement at work. Yay! These um mannequins are not getting any less creepy the longer I'm here. I was hoping that maybe if I was here for a while, I would start to get used to them. But there's just so many of them. I gotta go upstairs and water somebody's plants. I thought the light wasn't gonna go on down here because it's like one of those light switches that you do from both sides. Um, but yeah, because I'll be like, oh right, I remember where that mannequin is. And they'll be like, oh geez, that one doesn't have a head either. So that is fun. Also in my head, I'm like, every time I come out of a room, I'm like, what if there's a mannequin waiting for me on the other side? I just love freaking myself out. It's a thing I do really well. But yeah, I think I'm about halfway through my shift now, so that's exciting, but I'm hungry, so it's break time after I water these plants. And also, after that, time for me to and eat. Time for me to eat? Wow, my brain stopped right there. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna wear these plants. I'm gonna make myself some food, and then continue on for the day. I have so much stuff to do today, and limited time to get it done like and this is like stuff after work so gotta go home once i'm off here and make a list because I gotta get stuff done but time to stop talking and start watering plants now okay so the plants are now soaking and doing their things in the washroom i just have to remember that i left them there because if i don't then somebody's gonna come in on monday or whatnot and be like why are these plants in here <laughs> which would be really funny but not oh jesus the black one gets me every time i don't know why it looks most like a person why like i don't get it the green one right beside it psh, totally fine it's just i don't know maybe it's just because it's such a dark figure every time i see it out of the corner of my eye like i can see this one and i'm like oh right that's there or like this one i'm like oh yeah that's there but it's that one i think it's because it's so much darker than all the other ones just like draws your eye Anyway, yeah, I gotta move those plants so that nobody is like, why are these here? But that'll be later, if I remember it. I did write plants on my hand, so hopefully I'll remember that. That also includes putting them back in the office. But yeah, I'm going to make food now because I am hungry and get a little bit more creeped out by all the art and things. There, there's so many of them, but we'll talk about it more later but I'm not gonna have to deal with them for a couple weeks, and I'm very excited about that. Like, in all honesty, I think the work that's gone into these pieces is amazing. Like, I would not have the patience for that. That being said, when you're, I was gonna say home alone, but when you're alone in the theater, it's just too much, especially because we know the theater makes noises, and I maybe found a door that wasn't locked, so, any of these could be alive. No, don't do that because then I'll be like, oh, what if they come to, no, see, it's the overactive imagination that gets me because I'm like, what if they're standing in front of the door I come out of? What if they come alive at night? See, I don't need to do that to myself and yet I do every time. Okay, so I'm about to get out of here. So goodbye, creepy mannequins. You aren't gonna be terrorizing me for a while. And I'm gonna tease it a little bit longer because I need to pack up and get out of here. <laughs> That's right, I am packing a suitcase because I am going away. That is why I won't have to deal with those mannequins for two weeks now. Where am I going, you might ask? Well, bam! I'm going back up to Blind Channel to work for two weeks so the family can go away to a wedding, which is pretty exciting because I loved Blind Channel this summer. I love the family, they're great. I'm excited to go back and just like, detox in the middle of nowhere. So that being said, I don't know what's gonna go with the vlogs. I've been keeping my buffer for this reason. Um, 
so there's at least five that'll go up after I'm gone and I'm only gone for two weeks so I think what I'm probably going to do is just combine each week into a set of vlogs I, I, I don't know we'll, we'll figure it out as we go but today I need to pack obviously I'm gonna bring more than that <laughs> but I need to pack and I need to kind of get everything sorted because I'm leaving at some point tomorrow Strudel's mom the dog. Strudel's mom is coming to pick me up tomorrow because she's actually going to be swinging through town so it's perfect but yeah I that's one of the things I need to do and I'm gonna start that now. I am doing laundry so I can't get it all done but we can we can do some of it. All right I definitely feel like I have lost my motivation. I've got most of the clothes packed now back there and like I'm getting all my tech stuff together here but I don't want to do it anymore. I need to I need a shower and then I can pack up my toiletry stuff um, I have lists though of things I'm supposed to do and things I need to bring so I mean that's a good thing but yeah I'm just super unmotivated maybe I will jump in the shower and then do some revision for a while will that help I don't know and I don't know when I'm getting picked up tomorrow I figure sometime early afternoon because it's a bit of a drive and then a bit of a boat ride so we will see but yeah should be good <laughs> but yeah it should be good i just i need to get my butt moving like i can do something like this i need i need these i'm like I'm trying not to bring too much because obviously i'm only gone for two weeks but freaking tech takes up so much space and i need to bring food so i have no idea what what's gonna be in the store for food like probably just canned stuff the canned stuff wasn't that great <laughs> so yeah but I've got my cooler over there for my frozen stuff, and then tomorrow I'll just figure everything out. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna stop blabbering, and I'm gonna try to be a productive member of this room. <laughs> Time to pack the dried goods. Oh, I forgot to grab my mason jar, but I got my breakfast drink powder, two kg of rice, which I will never be able to use all of that, but that's fine. This I actually bought out in Blind Channel in the summer, and I'm bringing it back because I want to use it. Some taco seasoning, Annie's. I'm gonna put it in there. I think I'm gonna take the tech and writing stuff ugh, out of here. Put dry food in there and then see where we're sitting. All right, so I have showered and I've got like most of my dried food packed in there now. Uh, still a little bit of room, so that's exciting. But until one, the stuff that was just in the shower with me dries because I pulled it out or two, I feel like unplugging cords. I think I'm packed to capacity, I mean because I don't want to do any more right now. I'll get there eventually, and then all I'll have to do tomorrow is like last minute chargers, and what's the other thing? My frozen food. So I think, I think I'm think i in pretty good shape. I have no idea what time I'm leaving tomorrow, but it's all good. So I think maybe I'm gonna finish watching this episode of um, Covert Affairs, which I'm re-watching, but I think I'm going to finish watching that and then revise for a while, maybe? This is, this is exciting. <laughs> okay, so I have been at my computer revising for a while and I got two chapters done. One of them needed like no work, so that was great. The other one needed a little bit of work. It still needs a bit of work, but it's there's just a, like a really awkward sentence that I'm not sure how to make it less awkward. <laughs> and then I think the other thing I have to do in that one is just check something previously. I wrote it down, I'll figure it out later, but I need to get that off my bed so I can go to sleep. Um, because it's 11 o'clock. I don't think I should sleep in super late tomorrow because I don't know when I'm getting picked up. But I'd still like to get a bit of sleep, so I'm just gonna organize a bit here, get that off my bed, throw a few more things somewhere that I wanna pack tomorrow, maybe in my backpack that I'm gonna pack them in, and then edit the vlog and go to sleep. So with that, I'm gonna say thank you for coming along on today's adventure, and um, I don't know when I'll see you next. If there weren't a mail strike, I might seriously consider mailing out my vlogs, but I just don't think it's going to be worth it. But in any case, next time you see me, we'll be in Blind Channel or on the way to Blind Channel, so that's exciting. Um, and with that, good night.